hello guys and welcome if you are new subscribe and also click the notification bell so that you don't miss out on such great videos i'm going to walk you through the process of setting up vs code for java development vs code these days is is a very powerful code editor not just for java but for many languages including python javascript PHP, HTML, almost every major language, C and C++, and so forth. But in this tutorial, we are going to see how to set up VS Code for Java development. Now, the first thing you will obviously need is the Java SDK, which is actually known as Java or JDK Java, Java Development Kit which is a software development kit for java and you can get it from the website which you can download you can download from java from java se let me just go there java you can just download java se from oracle and then you will look for the the, the the latest version at the time of recording this video is uh, version 21 and there are files for java for java development kit for linux for mac os and for windows so you will download the respective file for your operating system and now once you've downloaded the respective file we'll go ahead and install just you as you normally would install any application so i've already downloaded and installed mine alternative way of installing which is easier for some people is to use a the use the command prompt or the command line so and use winget so you can type the following command winget install dash e dash dash id oracle dot jdk dot 21 and press enter and you'll be able to install your application you can just i will copy this in the description so that you can use it to install the latest version of java now after installing java head over to your vs code now if your vs code is you have just installed it will not have the necessary tools and uh, extensions that will enable it to run java and debug java so the what you will need to do is simply go to extensions tab or simply press ctrl shift and x simultaneously and then search for extension pack for java extension pack for java extension pack for java is a popular extension for editing java applications using vs code and it is offered by microsoft it is called extension pack for java it has other accompanying extensions which will be automatically installed along with it and they include intellicode intellicode api usage language support and so and project manager so after all the extensions have, have, have been installed you'll be ready to write your first application which you can and you can easily create an application using the following commands so simply press shift control and p and you'll be able to see the commands that are available including java create java project that way so you can choose that one press enter no build tools for this project 
and then the location where you want to write uh, I can create an application and to create a folder here called tutorial tutorials and then I will select that one as project location and then input the Java project name I can call it demo press enter so let me just close this one so you can see that a java project has been created in a java file called app source file called app.java has been automatically created and you can see here that we can run the application let's just run and see yes so there you go it is printing hello world so you are ready to write your first java application if you want to write another let's say another class you just click here make sure the source folder or src folder is selected first and then you you choose to you choose a new file and then we can call this one main.java and you can see a class called main has been automatically created by vs code if you wanted an interface you could automatically choose from the list that you are given let's say you want to you want to create the main method so we just type main and the moment we begin to type auto completion comes in and we can press enter to use that so let's say we want to print something java in vs code let's run yes so that is it guys that's how to run java applications in vs code by the way this is the latest version of vs code and uh, the it was recently updated february update it got its february update and in this update it comes with new features like speech recognition you can now speak to the editor directly smarter completion of python imports and so much more you can check the new you can check the release notes from here go to help and check the release notes so you can see multi casa inline suggestions is now possible and then we have server side by side preview refactoring there's also multi-language support for speech so it that supports more languages and i think it is it will be great so thanks guys for choosing to watch this video and i look forward to interacting with you again in the next video thanks and if you are not subscribed please do and thanks again guys i'll see you in the next one bye bye